You're probably asking yourself, when is New Earth going to arrive? When is it going to get here? When am I going to be able to go there, right? These are common questions that those of us on the Ascension Path ask, but it's so important to remember that New Earth is not a time, it is not a place. Forget about timelines, forget about event dates, forget about going to New Earth. New Earth is something that is going to manifest from within. In fact, you've already experienced some of the signs that you are connecting with New Earth, but you are probably not aware of them or you haven't made that connection. When you start to make that connection, you start to appreciate and have gratitude for the signs that you're already receiving. These could include synchronicities, the thinning of the veil, the being more intuitive, starting to slow down and being able to be aware of your ego and your mind, starting to take conscious control over your life. These are all signs that you are starting to experience new earth, but they kind of fall into the background sometimes, right? And they slip beneath our awareness. And I could assure you that there are so many more signs that are there for you that you are not aware of in this moment. So New Earth is not a place, it's not a destination, it is a frequency. It is a frequency on a, on a scale, okay? From the human perspective, we see generations as scales, different frequencies, different generations. As we rise up the scale, our vibration increases, it tunes us in to a new frequency up on this scale. And as we start to in, incorporate or embody higher consciousness, higher frequencies, your multidimensional energy, you start to be able to poke holes in this 3D reality and the light from these higher frequency uh, bandwidths starts to come through. And that's how New Earth is going to start to reveal itself to you. You're going to raise your vibration. You're going to increase or land on a higher frequency. And you are going to start to be able to perceive what is coming through. And that is New Earth. It's coming in through you and it's starting to manifest out into your reality. So if you're seeing synchronicities, know that you are on your path. You are in alignment with a trajectory that will manifest this new earth for you. You may start to see or experience vivid colors, more vivid colors. You may start to see and perceive energy. You may start to spontaneously connect with your guides. You may start to hear them. You may start to feel them. You may intuitively know that there is a connection. These are all those little pinpricks in that veil that was keeping you separated from that new earth within, from a 5D frequency, from a 6D frequency, right? Over the last number of years, we've been grounding, we've been integrating, we've been embodying high frequency light. It's been cloaked under the veil, under the darkness. And as we're going through these periods of time where the darkness and the shadows collectively, especially, are rising up, it can cloud a lot of that over. It's so easy to slip back into these lower frequencies, but know that you've been embodying the frequency of new earth within you over the past number of years. As you awakened, as you started to do shadow work, as you started to create presence, create space, start to observe your mind, observe your ego, start to shift those subconscious patterns by becoming conscious of them and making different choices. You have been grounding and integrating new earth. It is a new way of being. It is a new way of living. It is a state of presence. It is feeling or experience the frequency of love, frequency of joy, frequency of compassion. And I know that you've experienced these frequencies recently, certainly on your journey, here and there. Again, those are those pinpricks through the veil. So how do we continue to stay on this path and not slip back down, right? Well, first off, when you experience these highs, when you experience joy, when you experience that heartfelt love, unconditional love, gratitude, when you're feeling abundant in life, abundant in breath, abundant in love, it is so important to sit and fully experience that energy, that is new earth. 
We want to embody that. You see, your physical vessel is trying to rise up in consciousness with you. It needs to hold that light. And you need to be able to sit in presence and feel these higher emotional states so that your body can go through the process of releasing everything that's been in the way. All of your unprocessed emotions, all of your traumas, all of the things that your body has been conditioned to, to navigate a 3D reality, to navigate the old earth. We need to release all of that. So we need to sit with that. And we need to fully feel that energy when it comes up. But what leads into that is the ability for you to recognize the highs, the love, the gratitude, the joy, the compassion, the abundance, and feel it within so that can open the doorway for these old aspects of you to rise up, to be seen, and to be felt. And you continually bring it back to those high frequency emotions. That is allowing your body to rise up to meet your consciousness so that you can finally fully manifest the frequency of new earth. I can assure you it exists. I've experienced it. I've been there. I've seen it. It exists. We are so conditioned to the old ways of being that we kind of disconnect ourselves from it, right? So the doorway to that is to again align with those high frequency emotional states and fully feel them. Allow yourself to fully feel them. And when the density rises up, allow yourself to sit in presence and feel that as well. That will take these fragmented energies and bring them all into the whole and allow your body to rise in frequency. That's how we manifest new earth. We don't wait for some sort of external event like some sort of flash. Okay, We don't wait for something external to happen uh, in the collective. We don't wait for someone to arrive and bring us to a new earth. A new earth is within you. My Pleiadian guide said, release all sense of timelines. Any sense of a timeline in dates when things are going to happen sets an expectation in your mind and limits your growth. We need to release that. We need to fully embrace the truth of who we are. We are the light. We are multidimensional beings. And you need to trust the process. Know that as you ground and integrate, we get these downloads of light. And we integrate this light. That is new earth landing within you. Higher frequency you is coming down to land to be integrated into your physical body. In order for that to happen, you need to release the old baggage. It's time to put that baggage down, to allow it to be there. There's no need for you to continue to hold it. It no longer serves you. Bring your awareness, your attention, back into your body and align with higher frequency emotions that will condition your body to be able to manifest a new earth. I know you're experiencing it. I said it earlier in this video. You're experiencing a little bit of that magic. You're seeing a little of the pinpricks through the veil. That's the consciousness coming through. Why is it not fully manifested? Because there's a lot of space within your body that is still being occupied by the traumas, meaning the energy in your body is still vibrating lower okay you're at a lower frequency right we want to speed all that up we do that by leaning into the higher frequency emotions that gets everything vibrating faster that allows you to track attract more of your higher self as you go through this process you feel the highs you feel the lows remember this is a universe of polarity we're experiencing the totality of who we are all of these frequencies are available it's when we turn and choose to only experience the low stuff that keeps us suffering. It keeps us in a lower frequency reality, a lower frequency timeline. Choose, make a conscious choice to experience the highs and experience the lows. And you will bring it all together, create this amazing toric field in your body that will attract more of your light 
Your body will rise. Vibration will, will speed up. Your frequency will rise. And you will start to experience in your reality more of that new earth. So it's time to stop giving your power away to some external person, some external event to get you there and know that you have the power within to manifest new earth anytime you are ready. If you're with me on this, drop a yes in the comments. If this video resonated with you, please watch this one next. Thank you so much.